Fed up with complicated games, trying to keep up with the plot and who's stabbing who in the back? Well, X-Type is just the game for you. There's no story, no characters, nothing. You just shoot, which may sound dull, but the game doesn't make it easy for you. All you gotta do is shoot bigger and nastier ships. Aliens? Both? I don't know, anyway, even the controls are simple. You use the two control sticks and that's pretty much it. One controls movement and the other controls the shooting, so you pew pew as much as you can. You have two modes to play, either with a certain number of lives or a time limit, as well as a couple of other minor differences. The ultimate aim is to get your score as high as you can. You can move anywhere and shoot in any direction. Each baddie has multiple appendages that shoot bullets at you, so you return fire and try to destroy the main control section in the middle before you get destroyed. Thing is, because of how the controls work, you don't really need to pay that much attention to the enemy ship. Just shoot in its rough direction and gradually chip away at the appendages until you can get to the core, making it go boom. This allows you to focus on dodging the incoming fire and, trust me, it doesn't take long before you're under a whole mass of fire. When you see a heap of bullets coming at you and you manage to weave your way through it all whilst chipping away at the enemy, it makes you feel like an absolute badass, especially when you bring them down with that smug sense of satisfaction knowing that their best wasn't good enough. On the flip side, it can be very annoying when you do get killed. It tends to happen when you aren't paying proper attention to the incoming fire for a fraction of a second, so ultimately, it's all your own fault. You can't get annoyed at the game because it's you that messed up, so you go from feeling like an absolute unstoppable badass to berating yourself because your lack of attention got you annihilated, which makes this game very addictive. Once you run out of lives or time, you can upload your scores to a league table, which I have done, but I don't think I've come anywhere close to getting onto the scoreboard for all-time rankings. There's not a lot more to say about the game really, X-Type isn't the sort of game you could spend all weekend playing, but due to its simple and easy to play design, you can squeeze in a game if you've got a spare 10 minutes, but after that one game you'll probably want to do another. If you can get it cheap, I think I got it for around £3, then it's well worth it.